Hello everyone, and welcome to my Bachelor official YouTube channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribers button and give this video a thumbs up. Previous single man Clayton Eckerd is making a beeline for court soon over claims that he is the dad of twins. A lady he nonchalantly saw before this mid-year is guaranteeing that their one night together prompted her anticipating two infants. Clayton and the anonymous lady who wishes to stay unknown are as of now going this way and that while anticipating court intercession. Continue to peruse to figure out more about this breaking story. The son let the cat out of the bag that a lady who is just known as a 33-year-old digital broadcast have in Scottsdale, Arizona is charging that Clayton Eckard is the dad of the twins she is right now pregnant with. She guarantees they had a casual sexual encounter on May 20 that prompted her pregnancy. She says she had been assaulted and fiercely attacked in Walk 2022, and hence was not on contraception when she was with Clayton. The lady then guarantees that Clayton told her he didn't need a relationship. She said, a while later, he approached me and said he wasn't geared up for anything serious in light of the fact that the single man had truly obliterated his emotional wellness. Concerning Clayton, he talked with the media source and denied having sex with the lady. He said, my reaction is in the court records. I'm not caring about it since it's unjustifiable. We didn't have sex. The lady likewise claims that Clayton told her he wouldn't bring the child up in any way, so she is likewise recording court reports to have an arrangement set up for help. As per the report, the court records say that a paternity test was booked, however, Clayton neglected to appear. Presently, the court has requested a test which is booked to happen on September 26. The lady and Clayton are both due in court on September 28. The lady says she keep going saw Clayton on June 17 when he bought a pregnancy test and requested that candidate pee before him to affirm the pregnancy. She did so and the test was allegedly certain. She keeps up with that Clayton became cold and wanton subsequent to affirming her pregnancy. The lady charges he said, my scorn will possibly develop in the event that you choose to put me through all of this and my own damnation would must have you be a piece of my life. From that point forward, she recorded a police report saying she felt undermined by Clayton. As per her, he attempted to find clinical reasons a pregnancy test would come up certain. She guarantees he has blamed her for faking the pregnancy, with at least some expectations of truly getting pregnant if the two began a relationship. In the police report recorded, the lady asserted there were dangers, terrorizing, obnoxious attack, risk and blackmail from Clayton Eckert. She additionally said, when I let him know I was pregnant, he began composing unpredictable, counterintuitive, and undermining messages. He has been evident that being a dad has not been a major part of his life plan and would hinder his dating and expert life. The court record, which had the email to the police, closed by saying, I'm extremely worried about my well-being, and I don't have the foggiest idea what activities Clayton will take, since he is so unpredictable, controlling, disparaging, and derisive. At the point when Clayton talked with the media source, he let them know he intends to sue this unknown person for profound harm and extortion. What is your take on this allegation against Clayton? Remain tuned for additional updates. Clayton has not freely dated anybody from that point forward, in spite of the fact that he and next in line Rachel Recchia ignited dating bits of gossip in February 2023. Presently, the U.S. son can uncover from court filings that he had been in converses with another young lady soon after that time. However, she wishes to stay unknown. The 33-year-old digital broadcast have from Scottsdale, Arizona, guaranteed she had a casual sexual encounter with Clayton, 30, that purportedly prompted her becoming pregnant with twins. 
On August 1, she recorded a claim in an Arizona family court, requesting he take a paternity test, after he didn't completely accept that he was the dad of her twins. The claim was likewise documented to set up a nurturing plan if, as a matter of fact, he is the dad of the unborn twins. She is supposed to conceive an offspring in right on time to mid-February 2024. The two players are right now contending in court reports over the paternity test. That the lady has endeavored on various occasions to get Clayton to take a paternity test, yet he rejected. And Clayton is contending in the docs that she declined a paternity test. On September 14, the lady recorded a movement to seal the case so the overall population couldn't get to the reports, in spite of the fact that it still can't seem to be conceded by the court. The respondent, Clayton, makes purposely misleading claims against the candidate, Clayton's ex pro in his reaction to the request to lay out paternity that would be hindering to the solicitor's standing. The lady, a TEDx speaker, wrote in the court docs solely got by the U.S. Sun. These assertions, made under punishment of prevarication, incorporate party and is making up this whole case and is rejecting a paternity test. And pregnancy has not been demonstrated, neither has paternity. The lady proceeds to say that she's offered in excess of multiple times, recorded as a hard copy, for him to take a paternity test. At a certain point, the two of them had the paternity test booked and were set to go. The lady paid $725 as a store. However, Clayton never answered, and the test was dropped because of the Truth Star's reluctance to take part, per the docs. Hello everyone, and welcome to my Bachelor official YouTube channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribers button and give this video a thumbs up. Clayton and the mysterious young lady both have various stories when all that matters occurred during their connect that supposedly prompted the pregnancy, which Clayton is demanding she's faking, per an email sent in July that was essential for a court display. The U.S. Sun has gotten photographs of the young lady taken toward the finish of July trying to affirm the pregnancy. Clayton recently had gotten the equivalent photographs, which are screen grabs from a video, and he told the U.S. Sun that he accepted she looked swelled and not pregnant at that point. The young lady at first associated with Clayton after she was keen on working with him at his land office that had practical experience in imaginative money. She professed to be aware nothing about him, and that she had never seen his time of the lone wolf. She was looking for a venture momentary investment property and had started working with Clayton on an expert level. She depicted the evening of May 20, 2023 as, Clayton and I met interestingly and connected. I wasn't with anybody since spring of 2022 subsequent to being assaulted and brutally attacked, and was not on anti-conception medication. The lady proceeded. I went through the night at Clayton's condo, then checked out at the houses with him the next morning. A while later, he approached me and said he wasn't geared up for whatever might happen. Serious on the grounds that the single man had truly annihilated his psychological wellness. She expressed in the court docs that the pair participated in sexual action, in spite of the fact that when the U.S. son connected with Clayton for input, he denied any sexual movement. Clayton told the U.S. son in a proclamation, My reaction is in the court reports. I'm not caring about it since it's unmerited. We didn't have sex. In Clayton's reaction to the young lady's request, which was documented on August 21, the previous single guy mentioned a court-requested paternity test and that the candidate pay every one of the expenses. He likewise mentioned to be granted lawyer's expenses since he accepts the case is baseless and ailing in merit and told the court they never had sex. Clayton, who is busy shooting another show, affirmed that he has since booked a paternity test for September 26. 
In spite of the fact that results can require as long as seven days to get back, the gatherings are expected in court on September 28 for an early goal meeting. Also, under the watchful eye of this, the court requires the gatherings to meet five days before the consultation to determine whatever number issues, as could reasonably be expected. The mysterious young lady has not seen Clayton since June 17, when he bought a pregnancy test and requested that candidate peed before him to affirm the pregnancy. The movement for disdain doc proceeded to state, candidate consented and the pregnancy test was positive. In the show, Clayton clearly kept in touch with the offended party. I maintained that you should approach affirm what I was questioning. Furthermore, that's what it affirmed. In this way, I don't see you as a liar any longer. It got untidy genuine speedy as Clayton constantly impeded the young lady, so she was unable to call or text him. They mostly conveyed through email, as portrayed in the court filings. He likewise purportedly told her, Assuming it turns out to be my kid, I have concluded that possibly you'll take 100% guardianship of the kid, or it will be set up for reception. I won't be bringing it up in any way. Another message he purportedly sent her was, My scorn will possibly develop on the off chance that you choose to put me through all of this, and my own damnation would must have you be a piece of my life. She wrote in court docs. Clayton's way of behaving since the pregnancy test has been cold and merciless. He has concocted unusual situations where he has guaranteed that I simply needed to investigate a relationship with him since I wasn't really pregnant, yet needed to get pregnant with his kid during that time, despite the fact that I had been exceptionally certain that I had no assumptions for having intercourse with him on the off chance that we did.